Hello friends and greetings for the day. Welcome back to another episode of Technical Vocabulary where we learn meaning and definition of several technical words. As a part of today's episode, we are trying to get into another important aspect called as test matrix. Test matrix are basically certain calculations or you can call it as quantitative measures of one of the parameters of testing. There are several parameters which you can find as a part of the testing life cycle, including risk, defect, test, coverage, and confidence. Now, any of these matrices can be measured with help of the uh, matrices which we have as a part of the testing life cycle. And these matrices basically help us to monitor the ongoing progress and tell you the health of the test process at any point of time, which will basically determine that if you need any kind of control actions to be employed or deployed at that point of time in order to overcome the deviations from the scheduled plan or scheduled activities. Now, what exactly is the example of test matrices? Test matrices are just like simple calculations and formulae. For example, percentage of work done in test case preparation. Now, that's one of the matrices. How do you measure it? Number of hours uh, you applied to write your test cases for a day and number of hours allocated for a particular day. So you just divide them, multiply it by 100. You get percentage of work done in test case preparation. Defect rate, execution rate. Number of uh, percentage of hours or percentage of work done in test environment preparation. When it comes to the report, you can talk about report completion rate. That means you have 20 fields. How many fields were filled by the tester when reporting a defect? So there were 20 fields to be filled as per the reporting point of view. And maybe probably the tester filled only 15 of them. That is 75% of coverage you achieved on the defect report completion. Now, similarly, there are 100 plus matrices available. If you want more detail, you can definitely explore on different titles of matrices and you can find n number of matrices available. So we have 100 plus matrices available, which are relevant to assess the overall test process at any point of time. And be it any activity which you perform as a part of the testing lifecycle can be measured with help of the test matrix. Well, that was a short and quick tutorial on test matrix and I hope you got the idea about it. Should you have any other words with you, terminologies, do feel free to comment them below. I'm here to take them up and talk about it. Till then, keep learning, keep exploring, keep understanding the context. Thanks for watching the video team and happy learning.